With pick two, Fremantle Football Club have selected Andrew Brayshaw from the Sandringham Dragons. So I was sitting at, on draft night at a table with my mum and my dad and Cam Rayner got called out at number one. Um, and then, yeah, pick two came around and my name got called and I, uh, yeah, I was just overcome with all types of emotions. Um, so much relief. It had been such a long year waiting up to, to hear my name get called out. So much excitement um, and a lot of pride. It's something that um, I'm sure a lot, of, a lot of the guys that are trying to get drafted this year have been going through just working hard every day um, to try and achieve their goal. And um, yeah, it's, it's probably st still is the, the best day of my life, probably hearing my name get called out. And went up on stage, got my jumper, met Ross Lyon, um, went back behind the curtains and was just having to do a bunch of stuff, getting on AFL Instagram, um, signing a bunch of footies and jerseys. And then I heard Adam Cherry get called out at pick five. I knew we had another pick straight after. So um, I was trying to, whilst doing all that stuff, trying to still keep my, my ears open to see who we got. And um, about a minute later, Ches, Ches strolled through behind the curtains with a big smile on his face. And yeah, we just embraced each other. And, and since then, um, yeah, it's just been the, the next two years of my life have been uh, amazing and yeah I wouldn't, wouldn't change it for the world. Yeah it's amazing all my friends uh, and teammates um, cannot believe that any of my sons are anywhere near the top handful because of my modest career. Pretty Definitely. open through the week we read an article that you said happy to go to Perth no problem dad played at Claremont and you got plenty of family there so Fremantle pretty set on them having you a pick too. Yeah definitely um, family up there as you said family friends as well so just looking forward to flying out there and, and saying g'day to everyone and, and meeting all the players and, and it's just going to be a whirlwind but I can't wait, yeah. Yeah, there were some nerves, there were plenty of nerves, but um, probably the first half of my 18th year I didn't really have many nerves and didn't really have many expectations. Um, my goal was just to get drafted and be on a list. Um, but then, yeah, sort of as media start to have their input, um, a few clubs start talking to you, family and, and friends start expecting stuff from you, it's, um, it can be quite nerve wracking and yeah, you can feel like you have a lot of pressure on yourself but I got on the plane with, I think we had about 11 drafted that year and seven of us were all from Melbourne so there was a few of us on the plane over um, and we were all sitting next to each other and introducing ourselves to one another and, and my brother Hamish was towards the back end of the plane on the same plane with the West Coast boys who had gotten drafted. So. We drove in together with mum and you know, said our goodbyes and, and came over. But um, that night we went to Fifey's house for dinner and met all the other draftees and met a few of the senior boys. And um, yeah, once, once that sort of happened, it started to feel a bit more like home. And, and since then, just little bits and pieces have been falling into place. And, and yeah, now I call Fremantle home and, and I love it.